Startline Brewery is releasing a new IPA, which honors marathon pioneer Bobby Gibb. Bobby Gibb was the first woman to run the Boston Marathon back in 1966. This is Joe Baldiga, a director of the 26.2 Foundation, and, and I'm, I'm here this morning with... I'm Ted Twenty. I'm the co-founder and uh, manager of Startline Brewing Company in Hopkinton. Very happy to be here today. We have a big event where this is the canning of a special marathon beer by Startline Brewery. Yeah, Do you Joe, want to talk about that. Yeah, a I will. Bit? We're, we're first off, we're we're just so fortunate to have started a partnership and become the first uh, corporate sponsor of the Twenty Six Point Two Foundation right. Foundation back uh, when we opened up several years ago. And each spring during marathon season, we launch the Marathon or IPA and the proceeds from these beers, it's the same recipe every year and it's limited edition, those proceeds go to the foundation. And this year we're really doing it up. We are uh, recognizing Bobby Gibb, the first uh, female to win the recognized winner of the Boston Marathon. Uh, and we're using uh, some of the illustration and artwork from the book, The Girl Who Ran. Uh, which is a, a fabulous kids book and uh, we've used that artwork on the can and uh, this year our can release will be on Thursday April 8th uh, we have a couple hundred cases of these cans they are going to be limited edition and they're going to be highly sought after so we're really excited about this because it's not only helping get the word out about uh, the 26.2 foundation but it's recognizing a, a historic runner uh, for the foundation and for the marathon. Not only is it great beer, but it's a great cause. And as uh, Mr. Twenty mentioned, they have been a strong supporter of the foundation and they were our cor first corporate sponsor. And the 26 Foundation does a lot of good things in the community. We're hoping to build a international marathon center and we couldn't do it without the strong support of Startline Brewery and other corporate sponsors as well. So thank you very much and this is a Great beer, great occasion. We're very excited for it. Well, we're proud sponsors and uh, happy to be partners with you all on your journey for the not only the Marathon Center, but all that the foundation does in supporting marathoning uh, across the world. And should we get a little plug in? I understand Startline Brewery is now open for business. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, we've, we've, been, we've been getting through uh, all the challenges of the pandemic. And uh, yeah, we are open. We are fortunate to have a, a full house uh, during our open hours. Uh, those are on the website. Uh, they kind of we're going to keep expanding our hours as things come back and people get vaccinated. But the community support has been amazing. We've been very fortunate uh, with all the support that's been happening during awesome. the pandemic. Good. Hopefully we'll come this weekend. You're right. All right. Stay healthy, everybody. Thank, Thank you. you, Joe. Members of the 26.2 Foundation were happy to lend a hand during the making of the first cases of the IPA. Things are going wrong. There's a lot for me to look at to try to troubleshoot. Um, Today's going spectacular, though. Which I'm riding the wave of my Monday, which was also awesome. awesome. Right. Yeah. But yeah, everything comes through here, and then they come through these. And, and individually, I have to get my levels all set. And uh, normally, there's a lot of beer I got to dump right away because there's a lot of foam that's coming through these lines. Yeah. So. It looks worse than it is. I mean, some people cry a little bit. I did when I first started this job, but I got over it. <laughs> the Marathoner IPA will officially debut on Thursday, April 8th.